Here with welterweight Rashid Johnson. What's good, Sheik? What's up, y'all? What's going on? What you got going on today? Today, well, I just finished training. Uh, did a bunch of work, you know, staying busy. Okay. And when can we expect you back in the ring? Uh, soon. I don't have an exact date yet, but you know, I'm just preparing for any day that come my way. Mike, now, do um, you like try to stay around your weight? Like five, ten pounds? What? I don't really try. I just do. <laughs> so I'm, I'm usually probably five pounds over. Really? Stay around there. Yeah. Hey, bro, you like six? What, 6'2"? 6'2", six two? Six two, yeah. fighting at 47? Yeah. So you right. staying around in the 50s? Around, around 52, low 50s, yeah, 52, 53, usually around. Now, like, what do you attest to always, like, being on weight? Uh, it's just my diet. Since I'm diabetic and everything, I don't eat, like, crazy stuff. I, you know, I'm, I'm vegan. I uh, stay eating healthy. Okay, is that what that is on your arm? Yeah, it's a Dexcom G6. Keep track of my sugar. Yo, uh, how are you able to compete at a high level and being diabetic? Different. <laughs> Say the least, different. You know, just stay focused. You gotta want it. Is there ever times in a fight where it becomes a detriment or just by you always being on point with your nutrition, it doesn't seem to bother you? It doesn't bother me. I've been dealing with it since I was seven, so um, I just I stay on top of it. It don't really affect me at all. Can we expect you back in the ring before 2021's out? That's what we're hoping for, but I'm glad to talk to my manager, um, see if we can make that happen, but definitely hoping to, to get in there before the year is over. Now, are you going to stay at 47, or is it a plan that you could possibly move to 54? I'll probably stay at 47 for a while. I don't see no reason to be at 54. Is it, you think it's difficult for you being 6'2", being at 47, to find fights? Um, sometimes it can be, but not too much, you know. There's taller guys out there. <laughs> oh, uh, what's the what's the kid's name? Uh, Fox. Fox yeah, that might Fox, be the Fox only dude, tall, though, yeah. at, at 47? Yeah, he tall. But it's, it's some people my my height, like, uh, you know, like Shango, you know, same height as me. Mm. Uh, there's a couple dudes I can name. I can't really think of off the top of my head right now, but um, Jamal James. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Did you ever think of possibly making a go at 40? Or did you ever try to get all the way down? I thought about it, but I ain't really looking for it. If my weight just fall off, I might do it, but it ain't something I'm really looking at. Okay. All right. Um, there's a fight coming up this Saturday. Uh, Deontay Wilder is going to face Tyson Fury. Did you watch the first two fights? Yeah, I watched the first two. Yeah. All right. Who wins that fight? Say, say it again? I said, who wins that fight? It's, a, it's, a, it's tough. It depends on, to me, it depends on which Wilder shows up or if the new Wilder shows up. So we'll see. Uh, I know who I'm going for. I'm going for my country, man. I'm going for Wilder, the uh, bomb squad with this one. So hopefully he do his thing and take him out. As a professional, can you train, like, can you change in your 30s? Like, can you change styles? Or are, or are you going to always revert back to what you've always been? You can, but you got to be open-minded. You got to be teachable. You know, you can't you can't know it all. A lot of people that get in their thirties, they think they know it all. They're not really they're not really teachable. You can't really teach them new things. You know, they usually just revert back. But uh, if he got the connection with his trainer and he's uh, doing what he got to do, he should be all right. But we'll see. We only gonna tell when the, when the lights come on. As a boxer, like every time you get in the ring, are you trying to always constantly evolve? Absolutely, absolutely. You can't stay in. You can't plateau. Um, decision or stoppage? How does this fight end? Stoppage. I don't see it going to to decision. It's, it's either going to be stoppage either way. But like I said, we we hoping uh, while they're taking him out. Okay. Thanks, Sheet. I appreciate it. Yes, sir.